Preparation of food in leaves. In this module, you will learn about the process of preparation of food in the leaves of plants. Hmm. Seems like Sid is waiting for lunch while his mom is cooking his favorite dish. Let's go and see what Sid's mother is cooking. You can see that cooking a dish requires so many different ingredients. In the same way, leaves that are the food factory or the kitchen of a plant need different ingredients for making its food. These ingredients include water from the soil, carbon dioxide from the air and sunlight. Water from the soil is absorbed by the roots of the plant. From roots, water travels through the stem to the petiole and then to the leaves. The water is distributed to the entire surface of leaves by the veins. To take carbon dioxide from air, there are stomata. Stomata are the minute openings present on the lower surface of the leaves. Through stomata, carbon dioxide moves inside the leaves. The third ingredient, that is sunlight, is trapped by chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is a special substance present on the upper surface of leaves. Once all the ingredients are present, leaves use the energy from sunlight and change water and carbon dioxide to food and oxygen. The oxygen so formed is then released in the air through the stomata. The process of preparing food by plants from carbon dioxide and water using sunlight is called photosynthesis. The term photosynthesis comes from two words, photo meaning light and synthesis meaning putting together. Let's recap. Leaves need water, air, and sunlight to prepare food for plants. Water is absorbed from the soil by the roots and carbon dioxide is supplied from the air by the stomata. Chlorophyll traps the solar energy required for the preparation of food. Oxygen is formed along with the food and it is released into the air through the stomata. The process by which leaves prepare their food with the help of water, carbon dioxide and sunlight is called photosynthesis.